back at Lake Darnell State Park, the full field is returning back to weigh-in to show off their day one catch. Teams are looking to bring in their best five bass that will have them near the top of the leaderboard. Wyatt and Ridge with five from Campbellsville. 1287 is what's needed to take over the lead. You get over 10 pounds, you're going to be up there near the top 10. 1472, new leaders, you'll have a big fish you want to try. It's 581. They say no on big fish, pull them out, hold them up for the camera, stay right behind the scales, guys. Wyatt Pierman and Ridge Rutledge from 20th ranked Campbellsville University bringing a limit weighing 14.72 pounds to take over first place at the moment. Today was a pretty good day. It started off hot and uh, we had them about 11 o'clock and uh, made a, two more pulls at the end of the day and left them biting and uh, got out of there and hope we can do it tomorrow. After today it felt pretty good. We had a plan and went with the plan and it worked out for today and hopefully tomorrow we can do the same exact thing. Murray State, Archer, and Jackson. Got to go 1473 to take the lead. It's going to lock in at 1474. Pull them out. New leaders, you have a big bass you want to try. It's got to go 581. No, no big bass. Stay right there. Stay behind the scales. Hold them up. Archer Smith and Jackson Kulioff from second-ranked Murray State University weigh in 14.74 pounds to take the day one lead at the AFCO Collegiate Bass Open. And here's a look at the top 10 following day one of competition at Lake Darnell when the scales close. Murray State, Carson Newman, and the University of Montevallo all have multiple teams in the top 10. Murray State has the best showing on day one with teams in first and sixth overall. Man, it was awesome, dude. We uh, we fished hard. We fished with the troll motor on 100, and we did not let off the gas today. We fished wide open. We had about, uh, I think it was 1474. We feel good. The fish we found is a completely new pattern than what we had. But, I mean, I'm ecstatic. Um, we ran all new water, and it just worked out. So we're hoping they're still there tomorrow.